Most people will agree that fashion is best photographed on live models and photo robot systems are great for that. But today we're going to talk about the next best thing because sometimes it's just impractical and expensive to have live models in your studio all the time and that's where mannequins come in. We're going to talk about how we can use them with photo robot hardware and software, making your photo shoots several times faster and more consistent than if you were to do this manually. The first scenario is the most flexible one. One of the many applications of the photo robot cube is that you can mount a turntable on it. In this configuration, you can put whatever you like on top, including mannequins. This can be a torso or the bottom part if you're shooting trousers, for example, or a full body mannequin. The biggest advantage of this approach is that you don't need to modify your existing mannequins. So if yours can stand on a flat surface like this one, it will work on the cube turntable. The disadvantage is that even if you use lasers to position the photographed object, there will always be some human error. The mannequin will simply never be perfectly centered, which can be an issue no matter if you're shooting 360s or stills. Luckily, our software PhotoRobot Controls counts with this, so our centering algorithm will compensate for the positioning errors. You can do this manually or leave it up to automation. It's your choice. This configuration is for those who don't typically shoot full body images. When you use our special torso holder and adapters that attach to one of the legs, you don't need to worry about positioning. So, if you regularly shoot on torsos, having a setup such as this one is a no-brainer. Actually, if you want to be super productive, you may want to have two or even three workspaces. While a product is being photographed on one of them, the operators can put another piece of clothing on the second mannequin, simultaneously undressing the third one. The third scenario involves the so-called ghost mannequin, which is useful when you want to remove the neck part, for example, for some photo shoots, or maybe the arms because they're obstructing the view of the product. And remember, PhotoRobot is not all about 360s. If you don't want parts of the mannequins to be visible in the neck area, it is a good idea to capture the front and back only. This one attaches to the cube using a rod with a cone-shaped mount. But how will you remove the rod from the images? I'm glad you asked. Of course, manual retouching is a good way to do this, but it can be slow. Why not try our chroma key removal feature with a workspace prepared specifically for this approach? Using a technology that you may know from green screen video shoots, PhotoRobot controls can remove only a particular color from the whole image or its part. You just need to make sure that the pole holding the mannequin is a different color than those on the product. No manual removal necessary. Of course, there will be situations where you simply cannot do without manual retouching. And the PhotoRobot cloud counts with this. Without having to send anything to anybody, you can simply grant access to your internal or external retouchers. When they are done brushing up the images, they can re-upload them to the cloud, which means you can integrate retouching seamlessly into your workflow. With some retouching, you can even make it look as if the mannequin was never there, which you can see in this example with underwear. If you shoot 360s, it is a good idea to take advantage of our Spin Viewer, which supports hotspots that you can click on and view important details. But how about the mannequins themselves? After all, there are so many models on the market, it makes your head spin. For example, these plastic transparent ones are very practical because you can very easily attach the adapter to them and you can modify them any way you like. For example, here we've cut out the neckline. Moreover, you can order a special card from us, which can hold six of them and you can transport them from one part of the studio to another. It also doubles as a rack of shelves for any accessories that the stylist may want to use, for example. There are many kinds of mannequins, so if you are not sure the ones you might already have are compatible, just ask. The modularity of the system plays to your advantage, making sure it fits any kind of workflow like a glove. Get in touch with us and find out how we can make your life much easier. Thanks for watching.